Hi guys, this is Maggie from Rock Paper Copy and you can find us on www.rockpapercopy.com. We can help you with SEO, internet marketing and website optim optimization. And in this video I wanted to talk to you about uh, another SEO topic and this is um, backlink building. So basically building the links to your website. And there are plenty of sources and um, you need to be a little bit creative and um, thinking a little bit outside the box to find great sources of backlinks and in this video I wanted to show you another way to build quality backlinks. So I hope you are familiar with Google Docs. Uh, this is a great platform for sharing documents and editing documents with other people and also um, um, obviously creating because this is um, a word based on word but you can um, you can always come back to them you can share them with other people if they want to um, access them and word obviously doesn't work on all devices for example on my laptop doesn't work and on some other um, devices cannot work and Google Docs can be open on mobile uh, Google Docs document can, can be open on mobile devices and Basically, you can access them anywhere if you're not if you don't take your laptop if you log in from um, internet um, cafe, which was perfect when I was traveling because I could log into internet cafe, basically log in through my Gmail account and go to Google Docs and access all my documents if I wanted to access in important information or or simply um, work on the documents that um, I needed to work on or or share uh, with somebody else and. Google Docs is also uh, is also perfect for building backlinks, and this is by creating a document that is SEO optimized, so has got um, has got internal links linking to your website through the right anchor text. So, for example, the um, anchor text that is um, uh, your keyword phrase. So, if you're targeting, let's say, pet colors. So if you're writing an article about uh, pet products and you link uh, by highlighting, by hyperlinking pet colors phrase, linking back to your website, this obviously counts as an internal link and a backlink uh, with, uh, with obviously with your keyword. So it's quite defined backlink. And then once you create a document, give it um, a SEO friendly title and then go to share button on uh, Google Docs in Google Docs and then I think you have to uh, you have to click on advanced settings and you pick the um, public I think it's public access basically this this um, this becomes a publicly accessed document and because it belongs to Google it gives um, uh, it, it sends quite a strong backlink um, quality to your website. So it's worth exploring this possibility. This is the thing that I started doing um, right now with my company and with my clients when I'm optimizing SEO and I'm already noticing that uh, since the moment I started optimizing I created a um, document about two days ago at 8 p.m. and the next day I noticed there was a jump in traffic exactly at 8 p.m. So maybe it was that, maybe it was something else, but I think it could be that. I created something else as well um, during that time, something new, so that could have an influence. But um, having said that, I have to say that it's um, it's it's worth exploring um, different ways and obviously linking from as many sources as possible because with SEO and with backlinking, with, with backlinks, the more um, variety you have got, the better for your um, for your score, for your Google rank. So um, I hope you liked this video. If you are ready to um, um, to try Google Docs backlink building, uh, leave the comment below. If you have got a an SEO tip of your own, um, what worked for you when it comes to backlink building, please also comment below. Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more SEO tips and visit me on www.rockpapercopy.com. It was Maggie from Rock Paper Copy. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.